Alright guys, Chris with Black Rifle Survival. Got back from work, had another package at the house. Pretty excited about this. Um, you guys might have seen in my older video from Lester River Bushcraft. I uh, picked up one of their 100% wool Boreal shirts. Um, thing's awesome. Still isn't really cold enough to wear it, so I uh, haven't really gotten a tan chance to uh, test that out, but I do have it. It's ready to rock and roll when uh, you know, time's needed. But I uh, picked up something cool from them. It's more of a tactical uh, device. If you guys like tool rolls, I just saw this on here. It was listed around 90 bucks the first time, so I didn't really pull the trigger. But then I saw it for 60 You know, they dropped 30 bucks. So, yeah, pulled the trigger on that one. So let's go ahead and cut this open, and I'll show you guys what uh, Lester River pack. All right, guys, don't go anywhere. Um, okay. So the item in here is the Centerline Systems G-Roll, uh, gear roll. So let's go ahead and cut this open and uh, take a look at the contents. Now they have a few different colors. Again with the pricing, I swear I saw it at $90, $90. 60 bucks was perfect for me. Um, I bet I chose the Coyote pattern obviously. see what's inside. Okay. So here it is right here. Let's take a peek. Center line system. I'll go ahead and bring you guys over to the lamp here so you can see it, but I'll just go ahead and show you right now. Um, from what I'm seeing, it's got a carry handle up on the top, uh, single stitching, and then you've got cross weave stitching five ways on each end or the anchor points. It does have an adjustable buckle for your size, which is cat or dog eared, kind of like paper in a book in school dog eared tag so it's going to keep it from slipping out which is pretty cool I like that um, let me go ahead and completely pull that out I think or not but it breaks down to a pretty cool package you've got a large pouch a bunch of molly compatible uh, stitching uh, I forget what these are called, just the straps here, they're all Molly compatible. The pouch on the inside, this Velcro, pretty deep pockets, You've got something on the inside, ah, comes with four uh, bungee, bungee cables here with uh, adjusters, so you can fix that, but uh, I've already noticed that these are not tied off on the end, so these can slide off, I would tie a knot so that doesn't come out well, actually it doesn't really matter because it will go both ways regardless, here's the system let's go ahead and bring you guys over so you can see it now yeah, so you can see centerlinesystems.com this is again uh, covering up my information, this did come out of the Lester River Bushcraft from Duluth, Minnesota so as you can see there are these straps here and you've got the dog-eared stitching, so you can feed that through when your uh, roll is all full. Here's the carry handle, unfolding it. So, I don't have the exact dimensions, but it looks to be about maybe 15 inches lengthwise. So you can see, and maybe a foot tall in the width. But there's a large pouch here with Velcro. Okay, so I've opened up this pouch here, and this goes all the way down, so you could probably throw maybe a, I don't know if my Gerber shovel would fit in that, that'd be kind of tight. Um, you could definitely pack some like socks or something in there, maybe a couple fire starters, a couple tins, it's up to user preference. Um, you could probably throw some things in here, I've got some molly attachments, some bags. Might be able to do a small pouch, potentially, um, you know, you'd just be creative with it. But uh, this is pretty cool. It seems to be pretty compact. It'll be nice when it's rolled up. Now, I didn't really see any way to mount this to a pack. So this is probably something you just keep on the inside of your bag. 
be perfectly honest. If I could make one recommendation, I'd probably attach Molly to the back of this, so at least this could maybe be mounted to a bag or on the side of the pouch or something like that. But uh, so far it's pretty cool. Now this does have the large Velcro panel on the front for your patches, morale patches, blood type, whatever you want on there. And again, let's go back to the stitching. Pretty decent there. Single stitch. I forget what this pattern's called, but it looks like the reinforcement's pretty good. So. Yeah, this is just my quick unboxing on a new piece of equipment. I'll be uh, attaching some things to it. I've got a couple of my expedition pouches, some VanQuest stuff I uh, need to get put together. It was supposed to be for my 2016 bug out bag. Never got around to it, of course. Uh, it's 2017 now. So I'll need to do a 2017 bug out bag emergency response kit, etc, etc. Yeah, these, uh, these will come in handy actually. I might not use all of these, but um, I already have a few ideas rods and things like that so uh, yeah very cool so I wanted to say thanks to Lester River for another awesome product offered on their website I'm still very happy with my uh, Will Burrell, sh Burrell shirt I don't know if I'm saying it right very happy with it and uh, this tactical G roll pat uh, pouch not patch I'm looking here sorry anyways guys this is Chris with Black Rifle Survival thanks for watching leave a comment down below let me know what you think about this item here. And they do come in multiple colors if you guys are curious. So check out the website. I'll leave the links below. And uh, thanks for watching. Alright, take care.